Hello there, welcome back to Fred in the Shed. We're up in the radio shack, and as you can hear, being received on the Yaesu 450, we've got some skip now rolling in to the UK. Uh, foreign, U foreign or European skip. Can't, shouldn't really say foreign, should I? European skip coming in to the UK. So I thought I'd set up the little uh, Quanshang radio and do a frequency scan see how it uh, how it goes um i know you're going to ask me how i'm going to connect this to my outside cb antenna i have a antron 99 on the side of the house and the answer is i'm just going to use one of these little pigtail adapters you've seen these on uh, other videos they're not all that expensive i think in the uk they're about six pounds delivered from amazon you can get them for about four pounds delivered from china on ebay and then with this we just use a very small little uh, sma female to female barrel connector and that goes straight in to the top of the radio radio itself we're going to set up a frequency range scan let me just zoom in so i can show you that so here we are we're going to go from 27 at 305 up to 27800 and that should cover most of the euro skip coming into the radio if you're not aware how to set those high and low parameters um, i did make a complete video on that i'll link that in the in the description but basically once we've got that set into the radio we can then just hold down button five here and there we are hopefully you can see that that tells you your scan range and then once we've got the antenna connected we are just going to uh, press the f key and then button five again and then we'll set the squelch level let me just do that we're now connected to the outdoor cb antenna so we now start receiving signals obviously if you haven't got an outside antenna you can buy the sma cb long antennas which you can connect, connect to the radio. This time of year in the UK, the skip is strong enough that that should receive some of the uh, stations, but an outdoor antenna obviously will work better. Let me just zoom in a little bit further. So to start the scan off, we press the F key and then the five key. This starts the frequency scan. And we can see there's a few signals coming in. And there we go. That little line you see. It's quite lively as you can hear. That line you see above those peaks, that is your squelch line, depending on what strength of signal you want to receive. I'm going to bring that all the way down by using the F key. You take it up by the scan key. Scan key. I'm going to bring that just above the uh, line of static there so we can get the maximum amount of signals and that's set so we've got quite a few coming in and one thing i will say is and i've said this before that the speaker on the radio is probably its weakest link it's a very thin sounding little tinny speaker it sounds worse than a little transistor radio um it's a bit of a shame so what i shall do when i run the camera in a second when i do the editing i am going to boost up the bass slightly and reduce the treble make it a little bit more pleasant to hear but that's it as you can hear we have got some uh, signals coming in it's receiving quite well it's mostly on tune there is no clarifier as such to fine tune okay i'm going to start the uh start the camera rolling then so i won't be at the end of the video if this video is helpful to you if you want to listen to cb radio on your quang shang uh, just remember to give me a thumbs up on the video i really appreciate that that would be very kind thank you very much but as always Stay safe, stay tuned for some more Quanshang action, and I'll catch you on the next video. But here it comes, the little Quanshang receiving sideband CB skip. Calling somebody.
si vous nous entendez euh, ultérieurement sur les diverses fréquences, là on est souvent euh, sur le 4, euh, 415, hein, voilà, en, en QSO local, mais lorsque la propagation s'ouvre, c'est vrai qu'on a toujours tendance un petit peu. Charlie, uh, for 2060 QDS at static price, 2747, 